Hello everyone and welcome. Gig Harbor is in a big change with water quality. Recently, I worked with King 5 News to report the differences that have taken place over the years in our Gig Harbor area. People have come to me, the residents, saying I no longer swim in that water. Uh, they're really cool photos though. Uh, so a man who's been filming the waters of Puget Sound for decades says that he's noticed some changes that concern him. He took environmental reporter Allison Morrow to Gig Harbor to show us why. This video is from 2010 at a marina in Gig Harbor, and this is what the water looked like then. All kinds of fish and a lot to see, but this is the same spot in 2018. And as I sweep across the seafloor here, I'm looking for critters, you know, crabs, clams, anything in the seafloor. Doc Timke is a citizen scientist and filmmaker who uses a diver drone to study Puget Sound. For decades, he's watched similar scenes to this video from 2010, abundant colors and schools of fish and lots more. His video shows what the rest of us can't see, how our activities on land are affecting our aquatic neighbors. This video from a few days ago shows a dramatic difference. Now it looks pretty dead. Timkey says what he's seeing is starting to scare him. In this area of Gig Harbor where we're at, in 210 there was a lot more sea life in here than there is today. So I've seen it decline in the last eight years. His main concern is stormwater runoff, which is also a major concern for scientists who study salmon. The toxic pollution is known to kill coho. We also found tiny pieces of metal stuck to the magnet we attached to the drone. And I'm seeing a lot of change as far as our habitat. Our habitat's changing daily. And in a way, it's, it gives you a real eye-opener of what really needs to be done. People need to be involved. For Tim Key, it's an alarm. We all need to heed to become better stewards of our marine life. His camera may see for us, but it can't act for us. And Doc believes just one person with passion like his can really make a difference if we start seeing through his eyes. In Gig Harbor, I'm Allison Morrow, King 5 News. And Tim Key has been filming Puget Sound since 1982. He shares his video with government organizations building databases on the health of Puget Sound.